question 5e it says on the partially labeled grid below construct a histogram to represent the distribution of the volume of petrol needed to fill the tank of 150 vehicles now remember here it doesn't say frequent it doesn't say cumulative frequency it says frequency All right so we're going to have to find out the recorded value in each section here so let's quickly look at what these could be so, this is 150 but it had added some number added to the 129 to give 150 so if I say 150 minus 129 I would find out what that number is it's 21 all right so you had 21 recorded here the 129 minus 101 now one oh no 129 129 minus 101 that gives 28 so 28 here the 129 minus 101 so 101 plus 28 would give the 129 59 plus what give you the 101 I would have to say 101 minus 59 is 42 so the recorded number here is 42 all right 59 plus the 42 give you the 101 24 plus this gives 59 so to find out what that number is I say 59 minus 24 gives 35 so what I have here is 35 and then 24 minus 0 is just 24 so what you have is 24 could check and see if everything adds up again it would be 24 plus 35 plus 42 plus 28 plus 21 equals 150 all right that's 150 now as for the sec the, uh, as for the sections on the x-axis would start at zero so zero would be here this goes to 20 30 40 50 60 let's see if we could fill out the the graph going up two centimeters equal 20 un 10 units 0 10 20 30 40 50 60 yeah we could do that so it's 0 so 10 another two more centimeter 10 units also 20 Two more 30 another 2 centimeter 40 another 2 centimeter 10 more gives 50 another 2 centimeter 10 more leads us to 60 that doesn't really look like 60 I want this circle in the 6 right 60 so remember these are the points that we're covering all right now from zero up to 
to 10.5 you have none zero up to 10.5 after 10.5 once you reach 10.5 you run up to 11 so 11 so the lower boundary is 10.5 the upper boundary 20.5 I mean the lower boundary of this class is 10.5 the lower boundary of the next class is 20.5 so between 10 and a is between 10.5 and 20.5 you, you draw the line a little bit after 10 to show that it's not exactly 10 it's 10.5 10.5 it goes up to 24 so 20 this is 25 I drop one more 24 so here one two three four five you have these small squares each of them represent one unit up to so 10.5 up to 20.5 the upper class boundary of the first class which is also the lower class boundary of the second class so covering 24 is 11 to 20 but consider the boundaries going down below 11 I have at small as 10.5 up above 20 have as much as 20.5 or less uh, less than 20.5 alright it could be 20.499999 whatever number 9 you want but as long as it's 20 less than 20.5 it falls in the first class it goes up to 24 so identify the 20.5 don't draw the line exactly above the 20 to show that you know this 20.5 so the first bar would be that then the next class contains 35 so it starts at below 21 that goes to 20.5 goes up to 35 and it goes as high as 30.5 above 30 up to 30.5 go to the right of 30 30.5 and you have this good then at 42 is a class 31 to 40 so the boundaries can be as small as 30.5 so 30.5 you go up to 42 41 2 okay and up to 40.5 40 40.5 40 to 42 good then 41 to 50 was as high as 28 I'm um, the number I mean the number record is 28 so it's 20 25 6 7 8 so this goes to 25 26 27 28 counting the small squares 28 it goes from 30.40.5 to 50.5 50.5 so remember the 40.5 would be the smallest number that you run up to 41 and then the less than 50.5 would be the largest number you run back down to 50 so it's 50.1 less than 50.1 go down here right and then finally you have 50 to 6 51 to 60 the smallest number you run up to 51 is 50.5 which coincide with what we draw already the 50.5 up to 60.5 but how high does the value go I want this line to be at to just to the right of 60 60.5 how high do you go you go up to 21 so this is 20 and one more so 21 you draw this line up okay so let's 
my histogram that I have here right so that's it for question 5 for now